Hey everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel Learn with Sahira. In this video, I am going to give you a quick overview of the complete subject Business Statistics which is for degree 3rd semester students. By watching this video, you will be definitely knowing what are the important methods or what are the important questions which you need to focus for exam preparation and what are the unimportant or the questions or methods which you can leave in the choice. Okay, by watching this video till end, you will have the complete idea about business statistics. Ma. If you are preparing for your exams for your business statistics subject, then definitely watch this video till end. And if you are new to our YouTube channel, Learn with Sahira, subscribe it for more videos and don't forget to share this video with your friends too. Also an important reminder, ma, if you want all subjects and languages, important question and answers notes, which are easy, simple and clear to understand, ready for quick exam preparation, you can DM me on my Instagram. My Instagram ID is Learn with Sahira. Drop me a message, want notes along with your group name and semester. I will be giving you all subjects and languages, important question and answers notes which are very easy and exam focused. Yes, so keeping this aside, let us get started with the complete overview as well as important questions and methods from business statistics one. Okay, so this subject will be for 80 marks. Ma. This is the statistics subject which you are having in third semester. 80 marks question paper will be there and 3 hours of time duration will be there. It is also a problematic subject but definitely you will be also getting theory in this subject. I will be uploading paper pattern presentation as well as explanation videos. In this video we are focusing on the overview and importance. Okay. In our channel you will be finding playlist section. In that playlist section you will be finding business statistics 1 semester 3 under which you will be finding all the videos related to your business statistics okay so keeping this aside let us discuss about the important questions as well as methods so unit one is purely based on theory ma. okay it is purely based on based on theory and what are the important theory questions which will be asked from unit number three is it can be define statistics its characteristics scope importance and limitations which you can expect from Unit number one, already I have uploaded important question and uh, important questions video of business statistics ma. If you go to our channel playlist, you will be finding that video, you watch that video. In that I have clearly mentioned all theory as well as problematic questions. And also they might ask you what is statistical investigation, its stages as well as points to be considered in statistical investigation. Then they might ask you sampling and uh, different methods of sampling. And they might ask you how to collect the primary data. Wait, uh, what are the various uh, ways for collecting the data? They might ask you this type of questions from unit number one. Clearly and uh, I have uh, mentioned each and every question in our important question and answers video. Okay, please watch that video. Okay, so from unit number two, you might get, you might get theory as well as one problem. Okay, but I suggest you to give more preference to problem because problem is damn easy in unit number two business statistics is not a difficult subject ma i repeat it is not a difficult subject if you know the formulas you can easily do, do the complete solution getting my point it is not a difficult subject from unit number two they might ask ask you theory as i said you theory is included in our important questions video go to our channel playlist you will be finding that video and in problems, they might ask you bar diagram, ogive curves and histogram or pie diagram. From these, any one they will ask you. Definitely, you will be having two actually. One theory they might ask you and out of these, any one they might ask you. If they don't give you theory, they might ask you any two out of these four. But theory is expected. But I am suggesting you to go with problems. I will upload explanation videos also on problems. So, no need to worry. I suggest you to go with problems. It is damn easy. Okay. So, from unit number 3, you are having arithmetic mean, mean, median and mode. Okay. This arithmetic mean will also come in this mean on lima. So, if you are perfect with central tendency, measures of central tendency, it is known as. Okay. Mean, median, mode and arithmetic mean. If you are perfect with this, I have made very easy 
simple, clear to understand videos on mean, median, mode as well as arithmetic mean. If you watch those videos, you are 100% prepared for unit number 3. Whatever the question they might ask you, discrete or continuous series, series, whatever the series they might ask you in this, you will be able to do the solution easily. Full marks will be given from unit number 3. So definitely watch my explanation videos, okay? Arithmetic mean, mean, median, mode. Mean and median are very much important. Mode you can leave. But mode is also very easy. Ma. If you just remember that formula, easily you can do it. But if you want, you can leave the mode. But arithmetic mean and median are really very, very, very much important. As I said, you have already made very easy explanation video. So no need to worry. I will be uploading. From unit number 4, you are having standard deviation. It's coefficient. And standard deviation, it's a coefficient of variation. Okay, so this is one part and the other part you will be seeing Carl Pearson's and Bowley's coefficient of skewness. Out of these two, you can prepare any one because you will be having choice, right? In each question, you will be having choice. If it is 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, from 12th question, A will be from standard deviation and B will be from skewness. So, if you are perfect with Carl Pearson's and Bowley's coefficients of skewness, you will be able to write B. And if you are perfect with the standard deviation, you will be able to do A. Carl Pearson's and Bowley's skewness is damn easy, but standard deviation is also easy. Okay, if you want, you can go with both. Anyway, I will be uploading videos on both the topics. Standard deviation and Carl Pearson's skewness and Bowley's skewness. Whatever you feel is easy, you can choose out of this. Okay. If you feel like I can't remember more formulas, then you can choose any one out of it. But both are easy. Okay. From unit number 5, last unit, you are having Carl Pearson's coefficient of correlation and rank correlation. Okay. These two topics are there in this. You can choose any one. Okay. One you will be ask, asked in the question. But sometimes students, they might ask you both. Rank correlation is very much important. Ma. Very much important. Sometimes they might ask you. See, if you got prepared with rank correlation, if they ask you this and in this, if they ask you theory, it will be messy. So make sure you are perfect with both of them. But give much preference to rank correlation. I hope you understood. I will be uploading the videos on both the topics. So no need to worry. All the videos related to exam preparation will be available on our channel. So no need to worry. Business statistics is a damn easy subject. To no need to scared of. No need to get feared. You just need to understand the procedure. You just need to remember those formulas. If you remember the formulas and if you know how to solve the problem, how to substitute the values into the formula, easily you will be getting the solution. So no need to worry about the business statistics from third semester. Already advanced accounting, all videos I have uploaded on our channel. Go to the channel playlist and business statistics also I will be uploading the videos. Okay, no need to worry. If you are having any doubts, let me know in the comment section. If you want the notes of all subjects and languages, important question and answers, then you can text me on my Instagram. But little payment is there. Very little payment, but definitely you will be seeing very big results. Okay. All the very best. Bye-bye.